Scorpio, song that's playing for you is Return of the Mask. All right, so you back in some way, shape, or form, Scorpio. All right, you may have addressed something, and now you back to working on what it is you work on, or doing what doing it is what doing what it is you do. You back, you got your groove back in some way, shape, or form, because now you know the truth internally. You found the truth for you. You know the truth. Can't nobody tell you. Can't nobody tell you what you need to be defensive towards and what you're not being defensive towards. And it's like, now that you know what you need to be defensive towards, you're defending your passions and you're defending your truth. Return of the max. Scorpio's back. Look, first card out. Tower. Something fell. Something ended. Whether you ended something or you had you you had to let something go. Hey, it's, it don't sound like Scorpio ain't doing shit for being a Scorpio. You brought death to some. You brought a tower. You evolved. Good on you. Look, you fell out of love with an idea, a relationship, a friendship, family members. You put the title on the space that go on the space. But you let something go and got your groove bike in some way, shape, or form. A tower has occurred after a moment of pause for Scorpio. Scorpio took a minute took a step back and, th and started thinking about a space. You stop expressing yourself a certain type of way in regards to that space. And you may have realized something was unstable or something was unbalanced regarding what you were passionate about or just regarding your passion period. And then that had you had to bring a tower. Whether you willingly brought the tower or the tower was forced upon you, something fell. Yeah, look, it's something that was unbalanced, something you, you, whether you couldn't develop mentalities in this space or it was just like a, a tower to your lack mentality or a tower to you seeing something as non-abundant. You, you now know how to feel about something. You can see clearly now because something fell regarding unbalanced, something that was unstable, something that could not, you could it's a, if it's a relationship, then it's like you were in a relationship that put your feminine energy in the space to only develop negative feelings or negative mindsets or negative mentalities in regards to what you wanted to give yourself to or what you wanted to invest in. You were in a relationship or you were in a moment of your life in of in a time of control, whether someone was controlling you, emperor in reverse, or you were just a controlling individual and you had to take a deeper look at a situation and fall out of love with that mindset, mentality, relationship, friends, people, family members. You had to bring a tower of that in order to address something being unbalanced or something being unstable. You were invested in something for a long time that was unstable or unbalanced or had just had you in a state of lack. See, you may have once upon a time been celebrating these emotions and or feelings with people. Candy shop. See, once upon a time, you may have been in the candy shop in regards to a situation. You could have whatever you want. You could do whatever you want. You could express yourself away. It's like you could invest in whatever you want. But now it's like something changed. Something ended and that puts you in a different state now in regards to how you see what you invested in. Mm -hmm. Look what came out. You're no longer more confused about what you feel about you, you because you took a t time out to look at something and then that with that you brought you some enlightenment with the sun in reverse. You might not like what you see now that you can see and because you've seen something you don't like now you're defensive. You're no longer emotionally confused. You're looking at the space you participate in differently, all because of an ending. Whether it was an ending of perspective, an ending of a mental state, you built like a mental structure, a way of thinking, a way of feeling, a way of expressing yourself, and you didn't want to participate in anything but this way of living until something happened that made that way of living crumble or that perspective you had, that ideology, that worldview change. Now you're no longer going in the direction you once thought was a good direction. Whoa. See, look, people around you may be in conflict or you, you brought this ending because you were in conflict. Whoa. Yeah, look, now you manifest it. If it's you versus someone outside of you, it's like someone outside of you may have manifested your clarity. Or someone outside of you may have assisted in 
helping you see clearer. So it could be like a tarot reader. So like me. So if this is the wizard, which is the I, which would be me, someone outside of you, bringing clarity to your emotions in regards to what you feel about. And because you gained clarity in your emotions, you've seen something that you invested in was only bringing you lack, bringing you abundance. You brought a tower. You brought an ending or a ending has occurred because you can now see. If it's you versus you, then you're just in the state after a tower has occurred. You ended something in order to make space for what you want to manifest, what it is you want to bring in. You feel me? So you want to read, you want to invest again. Return of the map. I told you, Scorpio's back. Yeah, look, you know, you may be in a space where you're trying to come up with ideas and manifest. You're brainstorming now. Because uh, you, you at, at a moment in your life, you had the sun in reverse. You weren't happy about your current space or your current circumstances. But look, a tower occurred. Something has fallen because you weren't happy. Or because you realized something you did, you wish you really didn't realize. Or you just wish you didn't do something. And that you doing that brought an ending to something. Once upon a time, you were stuck in your head in regards to whether it's people were communicating to you. Or you were just stuck in your head because you were on undis indecision. Oh, excuse me. But now it's like you're out of your head and you can see clearly now. You know what makes you emotional. You know what fee you feel about. You know what you want to invest in. You know what you want to give your emotions to. Yeah, look, I told you, you out your head. You, you can sleep soundly at night now because you you figured you ended something. You brought a tower to something. It's like now you can get your shit back on track. Now you can focus on whatever it is you got to focus on. Because look, you gained some enlightenment, whether it was because of someone outside you, example, I, or you just became aware of something in your environment. You seen something, someone did something external to you that brought clarity in regards to something you're emotionally invested in. You saw a movie that brought you emotional clarity. You, you was watching a TV show that brought you emotional clarity. You may be dealing with an Aquarius with the star on the bottom. You don't got to be. But now that you are in this space, you can develop ideas and mentalities that will put you in the space to heal your reality. Heal what you got going on. Now that you're tending to yourself, you can heal those around you because you're healing yourself now. You feel me? Put your foot in the shoe that fits you. Song that's playing is good direction. I'm telling you, somebody gave you good direction. If it's not you being guided by something external to you, like if it's you versus you, you just got downloads. You got ideas you were enacting and that puts you in the right direction. If it's you versus someone outside of you, somebody outside of you gave you the assistance you needed to put you in the right direction. Somebody gave you good direction, i.e. a tarot reader. You feel me? Put your foot in the shoe that fits you, Scorpio. I'ma fuck with you, though.